Right, I'm using neither uh, two claws, two spark, the Sparker MK2s. Claws are heat sucking missiles and they do fire. Um, I think if the robot is hiding, hiding behind barriers, the, the missiles will fire. Is he stuck on that thing? He can't move, can he? Wow. They've got all the beacons though. That's the sad part. That's an Alpha Titan. Gonna use Orion, my mothership, on him. He's just found me. <laughs> oh my gosh. So I'm using sparks and claws to attack this Titan. Oh damn, you destroyed my robot. This is Amaz. I got two fainters and hazardous weapon on him. Also has remote assault, the turret on top of his head. And like I said before, there's two abilities. The first one is he drops the turret, remote assault, and then he gets the sprint ability, like he gets, it becomes faster. The second is uh, he can throw a remote assault anywhere. And it does actually, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh damn. Uh, he throws remote assault down uh, and it's it will actually try it will start targeting the it will start targeting the robot or titan or, or whatever it's got a good ability but i don't have that ability oh my god damn oh he's using two lanterns and um, a vajra weapon that's quite interesting. Let's see if I use my, there we go, matey. Then I'm gonna use my mothership on him. He's running away. I'm going invisible, attacking him from the back because that's where Titans are the weakest and he's gone, he's lost his Titan. I'm gonna hide a bit because this dude is doing the same. Let's see, can I get up close to him? All right, I'm gonna go invisible. You know, when you go invisible, you actually move a bit quicker as well. Oh, damn, man, this is why I don't like. Why don't people help? This this is the, ah, uh, damn it. Oh my God, we're, we're actually losing. <laughs> I didn't realize that. I, was, I just noticed it afterwards. I was like, I was concentrating on that Titan. You know, I only noticed afterwards. But the good thing about this is I only have to participate in uh, five battles. So, and then I will get, um, as you call this thing, then I'll be able to get some coins. So four more battles. Um, I'll, I'll show you why I'm happy about that because uh, let's see, where am I? Six, seven. I get five of those uh, chest things. I don't know what you call them. The, are they keys or whatever you want to call them? Right. Okay. Let's see. Uh, let's get back in the match. At the moment, I'm not happy with, with one of these. This, this mouse robot. 
I do I do want to swap these weapons. I mean, the laser weapons are good, right? I'm not saying they're bad, but I mean, sorry for the shaking, guys. It's just I'm not impressed by by the by them as such. So he's got four fainters on him. Actually, let me remove these two. And no, I'm just saying I'm not impressed because he's not doing as much damage as I thought he would be doing. So it's it's kind of like boring. Like I'm just losing my mass robot. I know he's a good robot, but he's just getting destroyed repeatedly, and he's not doing much damage. All right, I want to take this one. I've got two of those. I'll give him this one. It's just that this one's upgraded, slightly upgraded a bit. It's the same weapon. That and that is the same weapon. Uh, but I, I do want to borrow it for a second. I'll probably bring it back later. I mean, I can upgrade the weapons. The weapons aren't an issue. You know what? Just to keep them in line, let me, let me give him back this weapon. I'll give him back that one. And I'll just have to upgrade the, the weapons. I think I can upgrade them. Because it's just a match. Those that's a magneto, that's a fainter. Those are lockdown weapons. These are all uh, hazards, two hazards, one blight, the radiation weapons. Uh these are blights, radiation weapons. Uh spec ultimate spectres got uh ultimate all kind, two of those. Alright, I found this thing. Right, right. I can borrow that one. No, it it just makes it easier for me because I like having the same weapon, you know. Uh Venom is a toxin weapon. Fainter is there, and two ultimate or can. Right, let me see. What else do I get? Sorry for the shaking, guys. It's just um. Right with these robots, what I like about them, uh, those are bendy bullets, smarter and rust those. This is hazard and blight. Those are radiation weapons. Uh, those are all rust and uh, smarter. Those are all bendy bullets. Uh, hazard, hazard, blight, radiation weapons, and then of course, Rasdo and Smarter. Then the bullets, those are, I think those are the proper weapons for those robots. Right. I mean, I'm just, I'm just swapping out weapons at the moment. Like I said, I, I'm not happy with them. Let's see, oh yeah, I remember the name of this thing. It's called Crew Bane, it's the yellow one. The other Bane is green, isn't it? It's got the green thing to it. What has he got? Let's see. Da, 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 da. Right. <sighs> Sorry, guys. Um. Right. I taken stuff from him. Like I said, I'm not impressed with these with these laser weapons. They they just. Then they, they're not doing. You know what? They're not doing what I thought they're supposed to be doing. You know, I thought the new weapons. They're gonna probably be kick ass, but no, they're not. It's just, you know, because I'm playing the game, I'm noticing that it's not doing as much damage as it usually does. So, obviously, wrong weapons. He's alright, but I wanna remove this, this hazard thing. Right, let me. Oh, no, no, no. I made a mistake. <laughs> let me remove that. I think with, with the mass robots, the fainters are the better. The fainters are the best weapons for this uh, mass robot. Right, so let me see. I don't know, I've got three of those, one of these. I'm gonna give this uh, Typhoon the laser weapons. With the hope, with the hope that it's actually gonna be an improvement. I don't know if I've got another laser weapon, wait. Um, let me see the spectra. I, th I don't know what spectra is using. Oh no, he's got a faint on him. You know what I'm thinking? I I do want uh, this right. Uh, let me see. It's got venom. Just want to see what that dude's got. Okay, he's got a hazard. Right, I'm going to give him this fainter instead. Kind of matches, doesn't it? Those are laser and then the fainter's lockdown weapon. So lockdown just means like uh, your robot can't move. 
and let me see then i'll give him the hazard see it works out so he's got venom he's got hazard and he's got <sighs> sorry guys um he's got ultimate Okan. he's ultimate spectra venom is a toxin it's like um it's that green thing it's it's like um it's like acid or something hazard is radiation so that breaks down uh the enemy's um armor Orcans, those are just missiles. They just fire. They're not hit sick or anything. They just fire in the direction of wherever you set them. Uh, the hazard weapon, that's radiation. That breaks down, breaks down armor. Uh, the venom, this weapon here is like toxin, so it breaks down armor as well. They kind of, they're very similar, isn't it? It's just that they've got different names, but they're very similar in what they do. It's just that this one is radiation weapon, and that one is more acid weapon or dots or something let me check to see what this is yes it's dot so i was right it's dot damage it's 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 like it's it takes a bit of time to to break your armor but it will eventually break your armor right this one uh let's see it's it says energy shooting with energy shells okay so it's an energy weapon i didn't realize okay so they're not the same then because this one causes dot damage, uh, it's an acid type, and this one is actually a energy weapon. So yeah, so they're not the same weapon. I mean, I, I well, it doesn't matter. Right, let's see. What does this do? That it's got two fainters and a magneter. Wait, that fainter is actually quite good. Let me just remove this one. I just want to see because I'm pretty sure I'm taking this to. Yeah, to this dude. So, wait, what does he have? Okay, the the weapons are all the same, but I don't know how many weapons do I have. I've got two of these. Right. It doesn't matter. I mean, they're all threes. Uh, this it's the same weapon, like I said. Yeah. I'm just wondering if do I have that anywhere else? No. You know what i'm gonna give him this one just uh, you know just to give him a bit more power and then where was i supposed to go right back to this one all right it's almost like the same thing then <laughs> because look the fainters are both level ones right level ones and magnetos level three it doesn't matter i don't use these robots as much as as i would hope to but you know what i need to upgrade them anyway Let's see. I wanna. I, I always said I upgrade my robots up to level five, because at least that way I know they can heal themselves. I was trying to upgrade the Erebus, but that's gonna take a long time to do. The other way to get quick money in this would have been just to uh, sell one of the um, to sell like to sell a Titan or to sell uh, Titan uh, weapons. Then at least I would have upgraded it. But, ah, uh, you know. It's probably easier just to upgrade these dudes anyway. So I'll start upgrading this because, um, right, these are very low. The Spectre, Ultimate Spectre is also level 1, so that's quite low. And uh, the other Imigo is level 2. They're new, they're new robots. I haven't used them as much. I mean, not like these others. You see? The Harpy is level 7, Scorpion level 11, the other Harpy is level 8, uh, two, okay, it's two Scorpion level 11, and um, I think the Harpies are like level 7, 8, and 9. Yeah, so I haven't upgraded them fully. I think it's the same with these, but at least these are better. Two Typhoons, uh, one is level 6, that one's MK2 level 4. Uh, two Anglers, uh, one is level 8, that is level 9. The Loki is a level 9. So you see, uh, they, they're much better off. Just means you can put more modules onto them. Uh, this one, uh, two Hawks. One is an MK2 Hawk, level 3. That one's a level 5. Um, one Harpy, level 7. Uh, Typhoon, he's a level 4. I need to upgrade him. And uh, Erebus, level 7. So they, they need to be upgraded. And the first thing I've got, neither level 9, um, two mouses, one is MK2 level 4, and that one's level 5. 
Erebus level 8 and Angler level 7. Right, so I'm happy so far. I think this is the best combination. Because I think with Mars, he requires these fainters. He, he just does more damage with them. You know? He does more damage with those weapons than... I mean, I tested other weapons and it's not impress... It's not... It didn't impress me at all. Like, I was thinking, yeah, yeah, you know, it doesn't matter. It matters because... Um, I wasn't doing as much damage as I thought. You understand? Those laser weapons just don't suit Mars. So what I've done with the laser weapons, I've given them to Typhoon. And Typhoon's got the three lasers and the fainter, like I said, it's lockdown weapon. So if he, he might gain the advantage of freezing the robot and then that robot can't move. And then obviously the lasers will cause extra damage, depending on if that robot uses energy weapons. I mean, if the robot's got energy shield, because those lasers are good for that. They, you know, they'll cut through the laser. They'll cut through your energy shield first and then cause, start causing. They don't cause as much damage as I wanted to. That's why I was saying, uh, I was just disappointed. Because I was playing, I thought I've got three of the lasers. It's, I thought it's the same as the angler, but you see, the angler's got a heavy weapon. Yes, it's got the three light laser weapons, but the main weapon is heavy. So I think that's why it causes slightly more damage right so like i said before uh the reason why i use ds for windows for mapping is because when you want to map uh, a button on your gamepad it will actually produce the entire keyboard so if you understand what i mean by keyboard like the keyboard the keyboards that you use you know actually oh my god this guy's attacking me is anyone helping me is this just Wow, I actually, I actually got, oh my god, ah oh, damn. Right, so basically what I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, uh, why I like DS4 Windows? Because, you see the weapons he's using, he's using the, the fainters as well for his mouse. Um, so I think these are the best weapons for mouse. Don't use the laser weapons, they're not that good. I mean, I was using them, but what I'm saying is, you notice that it's not doing as much damage you see here, I'm, I'm doing a lot of damage to this dude. Like, I'm doing a lot of damage. I'm doing more damage than I was doing before. Of course, I got destroyed. But I, I, I was stuck in that um, projector, that fire projector. Plus, I had three robots attacking me. So, obviously, I wasn't going to last long, was I? But what I'm saying is, the, the basic fact is the fainters are the best weapons for the mouse robot. You see, when I when I press to that thing, that it doesn't throw the remote assaults like the other one does. Instead, it just gives me this uh, speed boosting. It says counting down, so that's like it's gonna come back to me, but it gives me a speed boost. Right, you see, you see, I, I'm, I'm more satisfied now with the fainters. I think the fainters are the best weapons for Mars. Uh, if you're going to use the laser weapons, I don't know. I mean, you might have better success. But what I noticed is the lasers are actually better if you use it on Angler. Uh, because Angler, like I said, with the Angler that I've got, I've got those, I've got, I've, I've actually... You know, this is a strange thing. I've got the the medium lasers, laser weapons. I've got the heavy laser weapons. I've, got, I've actually got three of those. My God. It's a mothership. I mean, a uh, titan. Oh, damn. So, yeah, let me produce my titan. And look at this. Look at the damage I'm going to do to this dude. In a matter of seconds. Look at that. <laughs> it didn't even last long. <laughs> I told you I don't like that Titan. <laughs> Look at that. 
He didn't do anything. <laughs> I was just like, da -da 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 -da, and he's he's gone. But that's what I'm saying. Um, the Titans, I I would say, do not get. Uh, do not get the Titans. Um, Ether, the one that I just destroyed, that flying one. Especially that one that's got the four weapons, the the older one. Um. The other one I don't like. Um, the Aether, the one that flies. Um, oh my God, this guy. He's got. Is this in Vydra? Oh my God. He's gonna destroy me really soon. Someone needs to help me, man. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. I didn't last long with that dude. Uh, like I said, I think the the difference is with this one. You see the angler. He's causing damage. Now, the reason why I think he's better is because at least he's got a heavy weapon. He's got a heavier version of the laser, you see? So I don't know if that causes, makes a difference, but I think it does. I think it does make a difference. I, I don't have a good robot. <laughs> no, I mean, this is good, but it's not good for up close combat, you know? But it might benefit the team. See, I froze him. He can't move for a while. Oh my God, he's so slow, man. Let me let me try and get this guy. Yes, you see, I did cause some damage. Gonna freeze him again. He's frozen. He can't move. Let me try and get a Titan Slayer. Oh my God, he's moving again. He can't move. He's frozen again. Ah, damn. I didn't get Titan Slayer. <laughs> but you see, I didn't say he's a bad robot. I'm just saying he's, he's not meant for close combat. He's, he's more of a sniping robot. But those prismas do a lot of damage. You see, especially if your robot uses energy shields, then these prismas will do so much damage to the robot. Because it's breaking through your shield, you see. So as it's cutting through your shield, Imagine other robots are attacking you as well. I'm just saying, if you're not alone, then whatever those robots are using will cause a lot of damage to your robot, you know? But the prisoners are really good, very, very good uh, for damage. But like I said, these actually do damage from 1,100 meters. So I could have just stayed on top of that thing. You see where, the red, where I'm going? I could stay on top there and just be sniping people. Well, I mean, they're lasers, so you're not actually, you're not actually sniping people. But the amount of damage you do, you see, he's got an energy shield, so that's why I'm able to cause damage. And look, I got him with my, um, I forgot the name of the, yeah, Orion, the mothership. Look at that. I hit, you see, that's a Dementor. Dementor uses energy shield. Look at that. All of the beacons. Imagine we won. That's it. No more robots coming. We got all the beacons. It's crazy, right? Um, the Erebus is not a sniper robot at the moment with the weapons that I've got. Those those are laser weapons. But what I'm saying is, the very fact that they do 1,100 meters. If you're on an open field, right, and uh, you're using the Erebus in an open field, then it's kind of like a sniper. Not really a sniper robot as such, but I'm just saying he's doing a lot of damage. If, if you understand what I mean. He would be doing a lot of damage because, I mean, look, look at it this way. This this Erebus, right? It's got that a cannon thing. I think it's cannons at the back, that cannon. And what that does is when you fire it, it's it, with the pilot that I've got, it actually causes damage with that. So normally it just freezes your robot, but the cannon, because of the, like I said, the, the pilot that I've got actually will cause damage to your, um, to your robot. So that's why I'm saying this, my Erebus, those prismas, all three of them do 1,100 meters. So that's why I considered him to be like a sniper, right? I'll read what this pilot does. It says Jade's competitiveness, all of Erebus's built-in cannon missiles now deal damage. You see? So before, if I didn't have this pilot, 
it just fire and freeze your robot wouldn't do anything else but freeze it but when it's frozen it's actually causing damage so yeah right let's see it says clang points got some clang points got some boosters right i just have to participate in three more battles and i was trying to upgrade um my error but that's not gonna happen now i mean I, I don't have enough uh you know i don't have enough capital to upgrade it oh my god i went to skyros i'm trying to upgrade the imugu the skyros robots i've got like five of those robots i don't use them at all i know you're gonna say why why don't you use them well i don't know maybe a personal preference I, I don't hate scarabs. I just <laughs> I don't know. I don't find it that good. I mean, for myself, mine are not upgraded to level nine, guys. They're like level fives, you know. So maybe when I upgrade them fully, then I'll see the potential. But right now, you know, I don't really use them. I only got one, but uh, I mean, one in my in one of my hangers. But I've got five of them. Let me find. Uh, yeah. So this is my scarabs. It's got steak. It's got uh, needle. It's got spike. Those are the new weapons, right? um just to prove to you so that's one of my skyroses and the other skyroses are in here somewhere I just need to find them uh let's see they should be together the one two plus the one in the hangar that's three another one four and then five see told you the the lightning robots i got five of those but i don't use them they used to be if you remember from my old videos it, it used to be in here with the Aether Titan, but I swapped that for this Hemindel. I think Hemindel's better than this than this one. I've got this one, and I've got the other one. Uh, this one, the normal one. You see, and it's a level 13, but I don't use it. Uh, this series is a level 17. I don't use it. That just shows you I don't use those Titans. I know that they're weak. If I use them, I'm gonna lose. I'm I wanna lose the Titan really quick. Cool. Sharing, I don't use it. I've got them, but I don't use them. I'm not saying the bad titans. I'm just saying, to my knowledge, my understanding, I don't like using them. You know what I noticed? What people are doing? They are mixing these, um, these ones up. Uh, like, I want to try it myself. I saw what they were doing. So they mix them. You see. So like they would have a, a Vajra, that one, and then they have this one. So I don't know if, if it's because the people don't have like the set, but I want to try it because those are level sevens. They're quite powerful. Uh, and I was using that set already, you know, but I'm just curious. I just want to see how different it, it would be. They're very similar, these weapons, They're very similar. It's just that that's got a more of an alien outlook and that's like a... I don't know just a weapon outlook but i, I want to see because i noticed that a lot of the robots were mixing them like normally you just get them like i can have all three of them i've got i've got the heavy one i've got the alpha one like this i can have it like that but i have tried that and it didn't work out the way i wanted to that's why i don't use it but i want to try this because i noticed that some of them are mixing them so that one i think it breaks down your armor that one must do more damage and that blocks you know that's my inver right there so i i said this a long time ago i think Indra's the best titan you can get if that's on sale try and buy it you won't regret it try and buy it 